<laughs> Check that out. Yeah, I got a uh, moped or a scooter. I was corrected the other day on Facebook. Facebook's always so weird. It's like, uh, I don't know, just always so weird. Anyway, I got a uh, scooter, moped, whatever you want to call it. It is brand new. It has 96 kilometers, which is roughly around 56 miles, I think. Yes, 56 miles. Um, this is not a name brand, obviously. It was very cheap. Out the door, he cut up some discounts, but out the door it was around 1200 bucks. If you was to, if you was to go buy you, not me, you. I did spend 1200 bucks. <laughs> uh, why you ask is because we didn't want to go out and get Groms again. We wanted to do something fun. We was like, what would be cheap and fun for us to get out of the house? Uh, we come across a couple videos where people are riding mopeds, but we didn't want to spend a bunch of money. So we were looking for used mopeds on Facebook Marketplace. We were on there looking around and we were finding them around anywhere from $100 to upwards of like 1200 bucks for a used one. They weren't named brands. Like this one's not a name brand, it's an iceberg. Ice Bear, Ice Bear, that's what this one is. 2023 Ice Bear 50cc. We couldn't find any like that was really good for, for what we paid for this one. Wyatt also got one. Wyatt got one, he was going for like a sort of Grand Theft Auto look and like the, the Faggio is what they call it on Grand Theft Auto. So he got that one. It was also cheaper. It was like $990, $999 or something like that. Again, the guy cut us a deal out the door. So he knocked, a couple, he knocked like a hundred bucks off or something like that for both of us. I was telling, uh, I was telling Wyatt when we were in there looking, so we went to look, it was a joke. We went in there to look at scooters, like brand new ones to see how much they were. We got there and we're looking around and like everything in there is off brand. Every bike or four wheeler, if it had a bicycle, it was off brand. Helmets were off brand, everything. We're like, we were like looking around in there and we we're like, I feel like I'm in Grand Theft Auto. And just so you're aware, every time you get on Facebook to buy a scooter or moped, most of them are going to be scams. I don't know why that's a thing, but that is a thing. And we learned that in the past few weeks. After we've seen how, much, how cheap these were, we decided it was time to buy one. But they're brand new for the price. For the price we were looking at used ones, like some beat up used scooters you could get brand new ones for. So we were like, let's just get brand new. We'll skip all the crap, you know, on Facebook Marketplace. So that's where we're at now. We got these Groms, Groms. We got these scooters. And I'm gonna get back to filming uh, adventures with them. I guess you'd say they're adventures. They're moto vlogs, I guess. I'm gonna put a camera here. It's gonna face me. I'm gonna have a camera on my helmet. So yeah, that's kind of the announcement. I'm also trying to get a camera for Wyatt, so we could do that. We do have several other people that are gonna get scooters, or told us that we're, they were gonna get scooters. Uh, Crispy's gonna get one. Um, we actually showed up at his house with these, and I did say this was a 50cc. Uh, the guy told us from the beginning that they only run like 29 miles an hour, which is not true. So we were gonna, we got it, and we were gonna like try it out. We didn't know if we was gonna like it or not. It was just a test, right? Just a test. If we liked it, we would trade them in and we would get, if we could trade them in, I don't know if we could or not. Well, eventually we were gonna get 150 cc, but we got these and we started riding and we realized we could get these up to 50 miles an hour pegged out, 50 cc's as well. So if you are looking to get a moped for the same reasons that me and Wyatt did, 50 cc is plenty. You will be able to do everything. You'll be able to keep up with traffic and just be careful when you get these off brands because we've already had stuff messing up on them. Not messes up, not, we did nothing messed up. Uh, we just had like a spring fling off of Wyatt's going down the highway or we were going down 31 and the spring flung off his 
kickstand. This kickstand fell and started dragging or whatever. So to pull over and find it. My carburetor was gummed up because it had been sitting for so long in the storeroom, I'm guessing. Because it's a brand new 2023, so I'm guessing it ain't sold. So uh, the carburetor was gummed up. I pulled the carb off. Uh, luckily, we're mechanically inclined when it comes to this kind of stuff. So I pulled the uh, carburetor off, cleaned it, put it back on, and it works just fine. Also have some, I also put some heat in it because I believe in that. But anyway, just as an announcement to let you know, guys know that we do have scooters and we are gonna do, we are gonna film the adventure thing. We're gonna do all that. I'm going to, I'm not gonna do this regular moto vlog stuff that everybody else does. I'm gonna mix these up into my regular vlogs, right? Because I am gonna start filming a lot. I'm gonna start posting a lot on YouTube. In theory, I want YouTube to pay for this Grom. Does <laughs> that make sense? I did put my old Ram mount on it, so you guys are gonna see that in a video. It's the one I've had for the past six years because I don't get rid of anything. Taylor says it's a problem, but we'll cross that bridge when we get there. I'll give you guys a closer look. Whoops, tag. You can read my tag, I guess. Oh well, don't matter. Did I swear this road here is busier than 31, Highway 31. It is the most ridiculous road I've ever lived on. Cars run up and down this road constantly. It's ridiculous. Anyway, hit the like button. I'm posting more videos soon. I'm probably gonna try to start posting videos a lot, like every day, so keep a lookout for that. Thank you.